Hello folks, Coach Tuberville here, and well, liberal socialist Doug Jones has done it again. Instead of standing up for our conservative Alabama values and voting to confirm Judge Amy Coney Barrett to the Supreme Court, Doug Jones voted against her nomination and represented the liberal beliefs of his high dollar campaign donors in California and New York. Doug Jones can't help himself because he's liberal to his core, just like Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer, Bernie Sanders, and AOC. Take a look at his record. Doug Jones opposed Kavanaugh and Barrett. He supports late-term abortion. He fought against building the border wall with Mexico. And in his first speech in the Senate, he announced that Alabama was ready to embrace gun control. Unbelievable. Ever since becoming our temporary senator, Doug Jones has opposed everything Alabamians support and supported everything Alabamians oppose. It's time Alabama had a U.S. senator who represents our conservative beliefs and traditional values. It's time Alabama had a U.S. senator who supports the Second Amendment, the right to life, and putting God back in the classroom. It's time Alabama sent Doug Jones packing so he can move to California and live among his campaign supporters. I'm excited about the confirmation of Judge Amy Coney Barrett to the Supreme Court and the promise it holds to our nation. Her presence on the court opens the door to finally overturning Roe v. Wade, securing our religious freedoms, protecting our gun rights, and interpreting the Constitution with the original intent of our founding fathers. We need more justices like Amy Coney Barrett and less senators like desperate Doug Jones. With your help and God's blessing, Alabama can reclaim its U.S. Senate seat from the liberals and put our state back in the Republican column on November the 3rd. God bless Alabama and God bless the United States of America.